Hello guys, welcome to Tech Gadgets. The fast track Liftrex uh, good, looks good and gets the basics right, but falls short in some ways. So this is a budget fitness tracker from Indian watch brand Fast Track. The Reflex has its share of hits and misses. What exactly are the points uh, which are good and what have uh, this tracker has missed? With more people getting health conscious, uh, fitness trackers are getting very popular. Although certain brands such as Fitbit, uh, Garmin and Jawbone dominate the market, a definite impact has been made by affordable options such as uh, uh, Xiaomi Mi Band 2. Uh, it, they are offering for only 1995 and when you consider that you can buy an excellent uh, uh, if you want to buy an excellent smartphone for around 10,000 today those affordable options look even more attractive yes so in, in the design uh, to take the affordable fitness tracker uh, fast track reflex price date only just 1995 the reflex is designed with fast tracks typical brand positioning in mind it is a budget tracker uh, with a bit in for the fashion conscious. So oh, they have released in three colors uh, that is uh, purple, blue and black. Stylish uh, but in a typical way, Titan's Fast Track brand is typically a budget offering targeted uh, at consumers uh, aging between 17 to 25 and has certain points of appeal in this regard. It wouldn't shy uh, away from calling the styling funky and this is something uh, that the fast track brand takes very seriously this youth centric image also makes fitness trackers uh, a very sensible department for fast track to take on the titan owned brand uh, would try its hand at technology variables uh, with this apart from this uh, similar to xiaomi mi band 2 the fast track uh, reflex features a capsule encased within a rubber strap the strap itself is a dual tone and uh, uh, you can see the combination of blue on the outside and the orange on the inside. Wearing it easy, loop uh, it, it through the gap and fix the two notches in. But uh, the notch itself has fast track branding and you can also find the fast track logo at the top of the strap near the tracker capsule. The look can be safely called youthful but it certainly feels a level below the premium looks on offer when you get on the fit, Fitbit uh, fitness tracker and uh, this also missing uh, some heart sensor other sensors also the tracking capsule itself is small and the pop has a simple LED screen uh, which is in touch sensitive there is however a small portion on the top which serves as a touch button which uh, activates the screen and lets you scroll through the various display options that show your fitness information and you can uh, connect it with a USB Type-A plug allowing you to charge the device by directly plugging it into your computer or a mobile charger. Since the capsule uh, fits into the wristband in only particular way you'll have to make sure you wear the band the way you prefer the orientation. So these have the basic tracking features and the most basic offering of any fitness tracker is counting steps and this is something that fast track reflex is geared around. Tracking is basic and accurate to a certain degree. There isn't much problem with go steps uh, and step count counting is mostly accurate uh, within a few hundred steps here or there. There is also calorie burn tracking and distance tracking but these are calculated purely based on the number of steps you have taken and figures displayed aren't necessarily too, too accurate. So you should uh, uh, consider the, the in a little way because if you consider in the full way they have been calculated by an algorithm rather than uh, concrete fitness data. So there is also a sleep tracking but it, this needs you have manual input the hours that uh, how many hours uh, you want to trigger the tracker to analyze uh, movement data and rate your sleep. Additionally you need to turn on auto sleep tracking as a band doesn't do this on its own. If you toss and turn a lot in the sleep this may turn out a bit inaccurate and uh, it, it wasn't so impressed with reflex uh, sleep tracking. So there is also very smart functionality with the uh, fast reflex able to show your caller ID when you are receiving a call on your paid phone. Along with uh, the support for showing notifications while the former works advertised. So this caller ID uh, is okay. Additionally you can also get uh, vibration through the app as well as set the reflex reminder which reminds you to get up and stretch your legs 
and uh, battery life is claimed to be 10 to 12 days on a full charge and during uh, 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 when you use it for day to day use uh, most probably uh, somewhat it will change and what exactly is the flaws uh, is that uh, with all fitnet tra trackers the fast track reflect comes with an app that lets you connect your phone to view and analyze data so the reflex app is available for download on android and ios and uses bluetooth to maintain the connection between the phone and the reflex unfortunately isn't very good app so there are so many reasons uh, for that because uh, the device caller id capabilities and it's uh, automatically rebooting the phone uh, uh, the app is not at uh, constantly tracking uh, and getting information from from the tracker so overall uh, it's okay the fast track reflex has a few key advantages in its favor the biggest of which are looks and price it sticks on the fast track philosophy and uh, for the same price you are getting uh, very good uh, uh, from my band uh, in that uh, you you will have an heart rate monitor also and although it doesn't quite compete uh, with parent company titans jex pro in terms of capabilities at this price uh, the fast track reflex offers about as much as you can expect for the price and mi band 2 also offers a heart rate sensor the fast track reflex has the advantage of easier availability to brick and mortar stores as well as online retails but whereas mi you can uh, purchase through online itself this is a good entry point into tracking uh, your fitness and sleep and worth try for its funky looks and affordable pricing so hope that guys you like this video please comment and subscribe for my channel for more tech and auto related updates thank you